Guys, the chicken is here bringing you another boom video. In today's video, guys, we finally got to 5ER. We went on a bit of a win streak, and we're going to go over all of that and more. Um, guys, make sure if you haven't, check out the uh, the merch down below. We got the hottest merch in Warships, and also make sure you're using that code chicken in the shop. It does help support the channel. And uh, yeah, so, bit of a change from yesterday. Uh, if, if you saw yesterday's video, ooh, bit of a stinker. Yeah, a bit of a stinker. It was not very good. Um, it, it was rough, but today, took a breath, took a step back, figured out what we were doing wrong, and we just tried to um, fix our attack, first and foremost, and uh, then just kind of look at the tech tree. It's like, okay, chicken, where are we at in this tech tree, and what do we need to... Um, the camera's all messed up. There we go. And what do we need to do to put ourselves in a good position? So... First of all, yes, my attacks were bad yesterday. I was in a bit of a rush when I made that video, and uh, blah, 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 excuses, excuses. Um, fully dropping everyone from the right, 3-5, 2-6, whatever. Uh, heavy Melon Bomber is, uh, is basically the only way to go at this point. Um, and then it's just kind of free clear with Brick. Now, I want to go over this, this, um, this base layout. Now, I've only uh, had one match so far <coughs> at 5 yards, but... The base is currently undefeated because I won that match. So, uh, the idea is basically, uh, you want to make it hard for the bombers to go down this way. You you, you want you want to pull them kind of when they get in towards the center of the attack. Uh, let's go over the replay as we talk about this. So, we don't want them to easily just you know f land here, clear both the engines on the bottom and the top. And then just make their way uh, forward. You want to make it. You want to set different anchor points. Um, that's kind of what we're trying to do here. I'll play this in, in four speed, so we'll just get into some attacks. But uh, but yeah, so they're going to come down this way. But the idea is that's not where I want to slow them down. They're going to go that way anyways. Where I want to slow them down the middle. I want them to start shooting everywhere and going in stupid directions and stuff. Um, that's what I want to have happen. That's why I have the shock blaster there as well, because it's a nuisance. It's going to pick off some bombers. It's going to be a, you know, it's going to be a pain. And uh, and yeah, so we, I don't know what happened. This guy just attacked us poorly or what, but uh, yeah, it worked out pretty well for us. So let's get into the next one. And uh, yeah, here we go. Five ER. Finally, we finally got up. Uh, we finally got here. We finally got here. So let's go one, two, uh, one. One, one, two, three, four, five, brick. Now, basically, all we're looking to do here um, is just save up battle orders and clear, like, um, the really bad um, mine or shock mine placements, um, things that we know the bombers are going are, are gonna to walk through. Um, yeah, so anything like that that's, like, directly exposed. Now, I'm, I'm okay with, the, like, a couple shock mines being uh, in the line of path because if the heavies hit them... That's not a big deal. The heavies can hit them all day long, and I'm fine with that. Um, what we want to have happen, or what we don't want to have happen, is, is having the bombers hit them. So let's flare up onto this mortar. And hopefully that's going to pull our bombers away from the bottom. And I shouldn't have flared that engine room. You're, you're better off free clearing than just going like full-on Hail Mary mode. Um... Because you will fizzle out if uh, if you just let them kind of um, uh, if you let them just stand in front of all the splash defenses. Obviously, you don't want that. So, and we're gonna try to flare this one quickly, quickly, quickly. And yeah, so I mean, in, in terms of times, you want to be like two forty-five plus. Um, that was weird. He retreat. Oh, okay. He's just trying to show off. You want to be like two forty-five plus. I'm not seeing a ton of. Uh, Three minute plus attacks, but uh, hmm. Castle was able to, to do us in there. But let's see what uh, let's see what happened there. Let's see what happened. So ah, okay, so they went up from the left side. Now I wasn't real. The base isn't really designed for that. Um, wow. Okay, this was kind of crazy. So, so she went like on a full uh, split rush, which was pretty cool. But I don't think a lot of people are going to do that. So let's go into the next one and uh, see how this is going to work. So obviously, you know, uh, you're going to be weak to something. 
I tried I, I tried to not just make the standard 5 VR base. I wanted to make a little bit of changes to it, but I think we are a little bit open to an attack like that where they're uh, kind of hitting us from all corners. But let's see what happens. Whoa! Three engines? What? That's crazy. Uh, all right. Let's see what happens here, guys. This is going to be interesting. So I think what we'll do is we'll try to take the U down with critters. Because they should get some pretty good value. Well, they should be able to chew through that engine with no problem. Or little to no problem, at least. And... There we go. And let's go like this. And just shock right here. If we get a couple bombers there, it's going to go down because obviously three ERs, they don't have that much health. But uh, shout out to whoever this was for getting way up to, uh, well, not way up, I'm only at rank 19. But either for three engines, that's pretty impressive. So shout out to this guy. Let's see how he's going to attack us anyways. Now three ERs, he's going to be lacking some, uh, he's going to be lacking some offense for sure. But I don't know if he's going to be able to finish the space. Uh, he got the... Uh... Yeah, it looks like he is going to be able to. It's going to take him a very long time. but um, Yeah, okay. So while he's doing that, let's go over the tech tree here. Now, <clears throat> there's two routes when you go to 5 ERs. Now, we can go straight up, save our keys, and go for shock launchers. We can also go for artillery. We can go for building damage. But what I think I'm going to do, what seems to be the... Uh, the correct choice is, uh-oh, I've been having some issues with my recording thing uh, recently, but what seems to be the correct choice um, is actually going uh, up through Warriors to get rocket launchers. I'm going to see if this comes back. There we go. Yeah, it's going up through Warriors to get rocket launchers. That seems to be uh, that seems to be the play. If you can get rocket launchers, make sure you can max them out. If you're gonna get rocket launchers and then be like two days upgrading them, don't do it. It's not worth it. Just you know, go ahead. Maybe come back and get them later. Um, two twenty-two. Not a great time, but uh, yeah, <clears throat> that uh, that's kind of what I'm leaning towards right now. I'll I'll feel it out tomorrow, and that'll probably be the next video. But um, yeah, so. Uh, even at four ERs, if you guys are, st are still stuck there like I was for the longest time, um, just do this drop like this. It's honestly this simple and this easy, it, and it works. So, um, yeah, if you're struggling or if you're doing the old chicken drop, just do this one. It's it's much, uh, much, much better. Much better now. Um, okay, so let's go. I want to make sure this boom cannon goes down. Okay, that should be fine. We should just run right through everything there. And we got an okay spread, I guess. Okay, let's go critters up here. We have a decent amount of bombers on the bottom. Ah, oh, we lost bricks somehow. Wasn't paying attention. Alright, so we're just going to free clear here. Yep, be careful around um, corners. Bombers like to get weird around corners. I just lost like all my bombers somehow. Um... Let's try to get him up top. And I don't have battle lords now, so we're just going to use critters. The only thing we can hope for at this point is that his attack is going to be a lot worse than ours. Um, yeah, so let's see. And we will shock there. I mean, apparently his attack is, hasn't hit one engine yet, so... Um, I don't know what's going on, but... We'll see here in a sec. And bang, bang. 226. Horrible time. Horrible time. Now he's at 316. Hmm. So he's coming at us uh, from the left side again. He actually had Kavon. But 226, I think he's going to have no problem beating that. But uh, either way, it's, uh, it's a good base. It's a good base. And... Um, you know, I think I just got to polish up the attacks a little bit. That's just kind of, that's just kind of the first look at uh, at five ERs, guys. And um, you know, you want to be like I said, two forty five plus, and you're going to be looking pretty okay. 
Um, even this, I, I, I think we had this one in the bag. I just kind of messed up the attack. So I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. And uh, there we go. Back to where we were, 19 and, and 5 stars when we started the video. But, uh, but yeah, so that's 5 engines. That's the plan. Let me know what, uh, what you guys think down below in that comment section. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching. That is going to wrap up the video today. Make sure to leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative. And we'll see you next one. Guys, check it out. Back, back.